road Atlanta, it is one of the most famous racetracks in the world. The design of it is, wasn't done by engineer, it was done by a, a guy who came out here and had a vision in the, in the early 70s. And with the topography and the elevation changes, creates one of the uh, uh, most challenging racetracks really in the country. Probably one of the most scenic and probably one of the best spectator uh, tracks there, there is to, to watch a race from. series was an idea from a man named Ron Barnabas. He came up with the idea of famous, historic Porsche liveries from the past. And that gives the series the cool factor. When you look at the cars, they're all Cayman S's that have been modified and turned into race cars, but the fact of the matter is they're really fun to look at. The idea for um, for making this series part of HSR um, really came to me one night when we were I was sitting in my office late, wintry day, and I, I'm looking in my office and I've got a picture of a 917 on my office. I'm looking up there and I'm looking at a Cayman that was right next to my office. I'm saying, that that graphic would look really cool on a Cayman. And I knew I knew how good the Cayman was as a race car, and I knew how good the 917 was. And the 917 was always my favorite car, and I love the Cayman. It's just a wonderful, balanced car. And I said, uh, wouldn't it be cool if I could marry the two together? So I got a hold of Ken Fengler from HSR one night, and I said, Kenny, I got an idea. What do you think? And he told me I was out of my ever-loving mind. Ron is a longtime vintage and historic racer, raced with HSR for years, and uh, he brought the idea, and at first I, I didn't quite know how we were going to fit it in, but the, uh, the idea of putting the historic paint schemes and liveries of these cars on there, um, credit the history of Porsche racing, uh, but still have a car that was affordable, safe, and had the interest of, uh, of, of drivers like this. The liveries are chosen for the car, each chassis number then corresponds with a number plate to that specific livery. No two liveries will ever be alike. By keeping all the cars equal, and we can monitor this very carefully because of the electronics that are in the car, we seal the ECUs, the, the electronic computers that are in the cars, we seal the engines, we seal the transmissions, and no one can go in there and change it. By Incorporating this into the series, no one can have an advantage over anyone else. It comes down to driver. It comes down to car setup. It comes down to car control. We all knew that the Caymans were excellent cars and they were fun to drive. We came up with a configuration taking the Cayman S, the 09 Cayman S, with the new DFI engine and turning it into a race car and creating a a, a, a platform that a person could buy a car, a product, take it out and love it. A little bit of suspension stuff to give it more durability, you know, from the beating it takes at the racetrack. Pretty much that, it's stock. These cars are green, these cars are street legal. It puts a smile on everyone's face and interestingly enough that we brought a lot of younger people into the series who maybe didn't understand the heritage of what, what's out here and gave them a whole new meaning of what Porsche has been about for so many years.